What's up guys, it's your boy Turnbuster65 Back up in this here today I probably should have did a little bit of this before I continued on But here we go, hopefully y'all having a good one Coming back to this game, today is a beautiful Sunday Ooh <laughs> Hold on, I don't like how close this is There we go Ah, uh, yeah, so I know last episode, I just got done recording it, and I took myself over here to Pinwheel Harbor, back to the industrial center, got the little the projector done for that, so now we got two projectors. I came over here, explored the other side in the industrial center, went up this shaft, or elevator thing, and got that little knocker collectible. But now we're back over here. Give me a second. It's been a couple days since I played last played this. Or no, technically yesterday. So things are a little bit fresh. But in terms of where to go, what to do. I know there are certain things I left myself to do. So nothing is new, Scooby-Doo. And we're going to solve that mystery. Trust me, baby. Now, I think we need to go this way. This way? This is the way, yeah, I didn't explore this way. Or I didn't even go this way. Hold on. The heck is this path? Oh, is this? It's a good thing you're wearing a hat. Okay, so I found myself in the oil trimming. Oh, look at that. I'm back into the place where I stopped at episode 3 and started episode 4. Or maybe episode 4, episode 5. I think that, yeah, episode 4, episode 5. Huh, okay. So if I ever wanted to go back there, I would just traverse this way. Go here. No, no, that's, that's the beginning. Wait a second, I was this close? So if I literally gone up here, I could have been here. Mother lover. Okay, well that's good to know. She saw a fall from the town square. Her ears ringing after the deafening blow. The victory shaft swayed, then began to fall like a pack of cards brushed by a breeze. Thick, black smoke erupted into the air. She told me that all at that moment, fear had swelled like a balloon in her chest. The victory shaft had fallen and a great accident had occurred in the mine. She feared we were both dead for a brief moment, but I was not there. It would take years to overcome this. We had to leave. I think I might have read that before. If I did, I apologize. But that note looked new to me. Oh yeah, we're back here. So C7 and C3 are in the same plane. Now where would this be relative to? I'm not sure. But I saw D11, C7, and C3. Is that relating to the sh the 18 valves I saw earlier? Okay, hold on. There's this projector which I did absolutely nothing for yet. Oh yeah, Marie. Let's see, but this is a door, not her locker codes. But I do have a sheet of paper, which I believe is over here. This. Wait, do I have an item on me currently? No, okay. So I'll pick this up then. Let me see. Now Marie's is 2218, okay. So if it's not 2218, that means it needs to be at her locker. I think the rest of the savings into hospital treatments all won't right. make this all go away. Whatever you say, girl. Okay, so now. Highly flammable. Keep stored hermetically in cool and dry environment. Do not use near open flame. Okay. Oh, there's plenty of this stuff. Okay. So this is what we're going to do. Since there's plenty of this here, I'm going to drop these locker codes. I'm going to stockpile on them. And then I'm going to take them out to the other open flame areas. Because there's multiple. So I'm going to take this one. I'm going to fast forward this part. Low key. All right, there we go. So I'll go ahead. Now, is there anything here I need to do? Oh, there's a little 
thing there. I don't think that's for anything. Also, let me touch this so that can be saved in my little collection. Even though I already got the open flame going, that pressure valve thing figured out eons ago. Starting to wear on all of us, Ooh. grinding us down day by day. This would all be easier to deal with back in England. Uh oh, so do I need to use this one on this flame? Okay. Let's see. Alright, so both of them are blue now. Okay. So I think I need to go to more of the locker code places or find more places in here to put the little ISO thing at. Hmm. But I think now if I go back to the thing, it should be full, right? Which I don't remember where it is. I know it's at a high place. Oh no, right here. Okay. Woo! There we go. Full. Okay. So I just need to keep shifting it. There we go. Full capacity. So now, do I need to taste? Now, that, do I need to put the this one into it? Do I need to put that here? No, okay. Oh, I see. Do I need to go? I need to think I need to activate that mine shaft below now because it's full. Right, okay. So let me go ahead and do that because I remember there's a little. What the frick? Okay, so I'm missing something. Pinwheel export. So I need to get something exported down here. What exactly? I'm not sure. Feels I need to put something in there before I do anything. Okay, let me make sure I can't put this in here before I try something else. Nope, okay. Now then. Let me put this back on to being full. No one ever didn't say that wasn't what you thought they were. Does that make sense? I... I don't think so, but thanks for the words of wisdom, I guess. Speaking of wisdom, it'd be wise to know where the heck I should go from here. But I don't, so you get to figure out that mystery with me. Speaking of, I wonder what we're doing. Today is hair day for your boy, which means it's usually I get my hair washed, and hair washing you used to take longer than it actually did. Now it's not so bad of a process. Oh yeah, there's this. Let's see, whose office is this? Do we know? It's somebody's. I think there are clues to know who this would be. Cause we got this here. Hmm. Mine station nine seventeen twenty three forty six. I know these are related to the captain, so they basically we know Sean is four hundred. Vorder here is 17. So I think this is it. So Jake, Nick. Hmm. Sean. Hmm. Okay. Uber confused on what the hell to do with this. I know I need something to put in here for something. Okay, I see I need to move that mine. Okay. I need somehow to move that mine over there to where that can pick that off. Okay, let me... Can I get to that? Yeah, I can get to that side. Cool. Let's see. I have no way to... No way in heck on how to move that mine. No way at all, though. Well, we're going to figure out something. Oh, my current sanity, you won't be wrong. 
Shoot. Wait. Oh! Wait a second. Oh, wait. This is Nick. Nick? What? Why does it not get my click sometimes? There we go. Nick? B. The, the Nick B is definitely the captain. Hold on. What? Men in contract. Okay. It's weight 84. I don't know the weight, but I do know Nick is the captain there. I don't know the weight. Is this needed to know the freaking weight? Is that it? Oof. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, hmm. Oof, I'm starting to get a better memory of this place, which is good. It's pretty good. Okay, so miner station. Okay, so they have nine miner stations. No, I completely disagree. What do you mean, Gene? That's what they have. So wait. 380 plus 12 is 462. Plus 12. Hmm. So shoot number 5 is right here. Is this all the different weight? It looks like it. Is shoot number 6 104. So shoot number 5 is dead at 60. Holy crap, okay. Oh. I like your handwriting. Thank you. Why the compliment all of a sudden? Okay, 60. That's not, that's not it? Excuse me? This is this not it. This is, 60 is not the weight? Is the weight not 60? Am I tripping? Or is Nick B not the captain? What? Oh, oh my lord. Alrighty. Alrighty. Yeah, right here. Well, Nick comma B. But it just has the dot on there. Don't tell me I need the comma. Don't tell me no. That this they're all dots. Oh my lord! All right. You know what? Whatever. Baby, it's whatever. Now let's get out of this area. I'm not. I'm legitimately not making any progress here. There's no progress being made here. Ugh, the smell. What, are you talking about yourself, Gene? Yes, your smell, you dirty horse. Oh, random locker search. I feel I'm supposed to still... Wait a second, there's one locker that... Wait a second. These all have different lockers on them. Oh, nameplates, hold on. Benjamin. 7253. Chris M. Hold on, okay. Yeah, that's the code I tried. One nine three five. Is that anyone important? No, it's not important. Okay, so that's what I need to do. Look at a different. Hold on, Jake. It says right here, yours is two five five four. Oh, part of it's right. Yep. 
Okay, nothing. Great, you've been in great help, Jake. Okay, Sean. 2910. Okay, 2910. Ooh! World's greatest miner. Mine warding. Oh, shoot. Sean. So Sean's the mine warden. Hold on. I found this coffee. I found blueprints. Hold on. And I found a hammer. Hold on. All right. This is okay. We're going to have to start stockpiling over here. Hold on. We're getting all of this. Because all of this seems important. Yeah. What? What do you mean I can't? What do you mean? Oh, that's lame. So I can't take the blueprints with me? Okay. All right. Whatever. But I know Sean is the mine warden. So if I go back up there and enter his code, I think that would be the case. Let's see, but do I need to know anyone else's code over here, or am I done? I'm just making sure, I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna go through everyone else. Nick B, he's a captain, so he's important. Go ahead, 5263. 5263. Nada, okay. It smells damp and horrible. Chris, all right, 1730. It probably just wants me to only go to Sean's. Since he's the warden. But I'm just gonna go ahead and make sure. Yep. Black light. Hold on. That looks important. Okay, we'll take that little black light. I love how you go there even yeah, I don't know. It's one of the mining captains. You're tasked with the emergency evacuation industrial. Okay, cool. Ah. That one locker I was at earlier would meant nothing because it wasn't named. Did that make sense? Victor, what? Victor B. I don't have your locker combination. Hmm. Victor B. I want to know what his is. I'm assuming not important, but if you're one I don't have a locker combination for, Peter, Rich Eye, Peter. Okay, Rich, I have yours. This is two one. It's two one five two. I want to say. What? Uh, uh, okay. Okay. There we go. Rich, did you get a chance to speak to the ward about your concerns with new controlled explosives for this new underground excavation? Excav excavation? Excuse me. I'd feel much safer if you brought this up before we began work on the first of the month. I also overheard Adam Westerman talk about the lack of the checks that have occurred regarding this new expansion. Obviously, his history was in safety over at Devlin, and he seems pretty concerned. Anyways, I'll catch you in the crow's nest later. Victor. Ooh, is that a industrial mine? Eh, a manual. <laughs> Another gas thing manual. Okay, 771. Ooh. All these manuals surprising. Nah, I had a joke there, but I ruined it. The air in here deceives me. I can taste the accrete sour molecules on the tip of my tongue. No one else notices. But I do. How can I taste something that's famous for being invisible to our senses? I don't know. But I taste the arsenicus, thickest cream mingled with the air in here. Not enough rags to cover our faces, and not enough masks to share with the miners below. I grimace with every breath that I take, and a fear wells up inside of me. Still, the other girls and I need to get this shipment done soon. Otherwise, we'll have Oliver and Aaron panicking. Okay. 
Alright, well... Might have to get some of that out, to be honest. Wasn't as exciting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can stay there. What if I need to put the little coffee mug here? See, I didn't get coffee. That was a thing. Is this important? Oh, Sean V. Sean V is there and has that thing. Let me go to the blueprints. You don't say much, do you? Well, I don't really need a reason to talk now, do I, Gene? You usually do all the talking with your big mouth. You do something else with it, too, but I'm not going to say it here. Anyway. Hmm. Stretch it. I feel this is important. So I need the hammer. I need to strike it there. That's what I need it for. Okay, so... Where I'm at, I'm at the Miner's Dry? It's the Mining Ward. I'm, I'm, in that, I'm in that room. Okay. Yeah, so this is Long Bench, right? I know there's somewhere I need to strike in here with a hammer. The hammer seems important for that purpose. So I bust in there. Oh, my lord. I don't know. It's like I think I get it because this is the mine warden's office. Okay. So if I look at it that way, there's also a thing here. And also How did we, we get here? I can't remember. I don't know either. But I'll tell you here soon, Gene, so don't worry about it. Okay, so the my warden's right there. That means I know where I am. I'm right there. Okay, so the left, I need to go to that. Okay. So from here, I need to strike here. <laughs> That's it. It's right here. This is the weak structure. And the hammer is not it. But that's where the weak structure is. I don't think it's this. No, it wasn't. Okay. It was reacting with the hammer, though. Which means I need to do something here first. There's something I need to do here first. So it is the hammer that I have to strike there, but it's something I need to do there first. Now, where's the other weak structure? The weak structure, okay, so it's the bottom. So it's the bottom near that door. So right here. What? No, 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 no. I, I got a little lost now. I got a little lost. Hold on. So it's. Where? This doesn't seem like the right way. Don't worry about it. Wait, so, oh, this one, this one already broke, right? That already broke. Okay, well, I'm gonna get back to it later. Uh, let's see. Where's another place I can go? But I know what to do now, so. Over here is something important. Now I need to break into later. Right now, I need to do something else. Surprised I haven't got all the things here yet. How long I've been here? Oh, yeah, this motherfucker. Okay. Do not use more. Mines will only unlock at 18 units. Three times that.
Wait, what? Wait, oh god, I think I fucked it up already. Oh god. It's locked. Yeah, I know I fucked it up. Frick. I have no way of... Oh, Jesus. Uh, well... Whew, man, I'm gonna have to do a bunch of cutting here. <laughs> I mean, there are certain places that I see stuff at. Arsenic disposal. Arsenic disposal, okay. <gasps> Zero one one two. Zero one one two. Is that the code for that place? Okay, well, first off, let me test to see if it's not for that. Okay. Thought that was obvious, but let me go back to the other two places now. Frick. Right. Ooh, oh, wait a second. This is new. I didn't go this way before, did I? No. D11. There's D11 again. Wait a second. D11. Hmm. Okay. Oh my lord, these are random pressure valves. What the frick do I would I need them? That mother lover stairs This is why. But what also what is this for? 100, 100, 300, 200. Wait, no, these are all the These are all the Oh, the arsenic? Or trimming, miners dry, mill management. There's four. I don't think I gotten the last one. It's three, one, 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 two. I didn't know each one had its own pressure thing. Okay. This is the miners dry. And I think I already. Whoa. Needs a washroom. Hold on. Did I already? I see. Let's see, I'm gonna go downstairs to read it instead of going back there. Ooh, this has been a very productive episode. I know. <laughs> 300, 100, 200, 300, 100. It's a little pattern. 200, 300. Oh, there we go. What? What is it? Oh, is it 300, 100? Two hundred. Nani? Nanda to? Excuse me, what? Three hundred, one hundred, two hundred, three hundred. Oh, one hundred. There we go. A stadium almost full with screaming fans. His little eyes taking it in for the first time. These cramped rooms were where the miners spent most of their time before going underground. It was like a community here. Records show that the mining wardens usually put a lot of undue pressure on the miners to meet quotas. Uh, it must have been a grueling job. Mm hmm. Now I can strike this with the hammer. Okay. There we go. Woof. Oh man, what? I still can't strike it yet. Mother lover. Okay. But that did do something. Let's see. Do I need a spanner to fix these wrenches? Fix these wrenches. Do I need a spanner? No spanner. Spanner nor spanning. Okay. Apologies for going dry here. Uh, it's just my bur my brain coming back to this. It's been it's been a been a dull episode, to say the least. There's things that I'm doing, things that I'm not doing, and it's just it's just one big crap a log. What? Okay, no. I know I'm missing a bow too. 
certainly missing a bow. But look at that. So I gotta find out where the heck the bow is. It might be that place where I'm missing stairs at. I think there is a way that I have not been yet, due to my stubbornness. That is this way. And that's where the last thing is, okay. I apologize, it took me up to this point to get there. I did a lot of traveling and traversing around, but... There you go, that's your reminder, wash your bed sheets today. I also recorded 40 minutes, which is no, no way in hell I'm going to subject that all to you, on to you, so... Being on the outside, it's hard not knowing what we're going to encounter next within the mind. If I'm honest, it puts me on edge. Yet, if you do succeed, you'll have played a part in changing history forever. If I'm being truthful, I don't know how this process will affect you. Let's both plan for the worst and hope for the best. From my readings, that seems to be all of the ribbons from this area. Before you head back to the case, though, we need to find the artifact. My readings show a very strong signal coming from nearby. Search for anything that illuminates, anything that stands out from the crowd. I'll contact you when we're closer to it. Okay, so now the stairs are here. A so. large bundle of postcards just laying in a pile on the front porch. This is called a victory shaft. Apparently it could be seen for miles around and controlled the central operation to the industrial area. Each of the four work pillars were pivotal in Pinwell's economic success, and all of them, working to full capacity, was required to create a sustainable export operation. Ah, oh, so... France, Portugal, Cyprus, America. They could have been sent at any time. Wait, what? I'm not sure what's going on with that. I, I'm really not. So I'm gonna stop messing with it. <laughs> oh my lord. Okay. That is a wreckage mess. So. Alright, we've got all our eight ribbons. I've gotten everything here in conjunction or aligned with the mumbo and the jumbo. So there we go. Got all the ribbons. We kind of did stuff this episode. We kind of did. And the stuff we did, I'll put in. The stuff we dicked around on, I'll maybe leave. To subject you for the torture. Or not. Just to make sure that you stay and remain on my channel. But. Alright, let's go ahead and. I don't know how to feel. I don't know what to do and I don't know how to feel. And I've been recording. This doesn't seem like the right way. The mill management spot. Let me get back up here. I don't know what the numbers are supposed to mean. I see C3, I see C7, I see J7, I see D11. Not sure what it's all supposed to mean. But I think our scenic shipment to shipped on the barograph is supposed to say something. No, it is. It's supposed to say say something. It's supposed to mean something. Twenty five thirty twenty eight twenty nine twenty nine twenty eight twenty nine Maybe the sixteenth? Maybe 
almost got this projection down, so I have to figure out what this is. The day. Day. Wait. What? Day, date, month. Monday, like the 16th to to hmm, I'm not sure. Pinwheel miners kept alive by New Deal. Okay. Oh, wait. No. The USA. We're shipping it to. Do I need it to say in the United States? Most of you end up selling these. Ooh. But okay. it's meant to be a keepsake to remind you of your time here. We wish you all the best. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's go, baby. Okay. So I may have not done much, but at least I got a projection done in this episode. All right. So let's go. I'm referencing the diary once more, and this watch was a gift at the age of 16. As far as I can tell, it might represent a sense of freedom or realization of self-awareness in the world. When I strapped it to the patient's wrist, there was a positive reaction. Although unable to understand how to read the correct time, it was obvious to me that the sensation of the watch on the skin was well received. Okay. The frick? Huh? Oh! The stuff here working now because I completed the projection. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, not supposed to be. I'm supposed. I think it has a signature, but there we go. Okay. So, yeah, we're running up on time here. Thank you guys for watching. Apologies for the cutting and editing in this episode. Things got real dull. I got stuck and I didn't want to show you at all, but I'm glad I got some progress done. I got all the ribbons and next episode we'll try to find a core memory here. Thank you guys for watching. Like this video. Subscribe to become a treader today. Peace, baby.